So this is the uh, XTM Terminator 2. In my opinion, this is actually one of the well, most well-made and, uh, and robust um, 1 8 four-wheel drive radio control buggies there is. Uh, we're going to give this one a run around the garden, see how it behaves itself. Uh, but before we do that, let's have a, a look under the bonnet. So I've already got the clips out of the uh, body shell on this one. We'll lift the shell off and we'll have a quick look underneath. And there we are. There's the uh, XTM. It's a 247 engine. Uh, again, it's one of the, 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 the best engines, I think, that's available. They're very strong, very reliable, and hardly ever go wrong if they're looked after correctly. So we're going to um, start this one up. But before we do, uh, let's just turn the car on and we'll extend the aerial and turn the transmitter on. And we'll do a quick, uh, quick couple of checks to make sure everything's behaving itself. So first thing we're going to do is steering. And we can see the steering works well there. And also throttle. Throttle looks good, as does the brake. This has got a small movement on the brake on this one, so it brakes nice and hard. Uh, I need that because it's quite a fast car. So we're going to give this one a start, and we're going to run it around the garden and see how it behaves. So the first thing we do is put the throttle up to um, about halfway on the trim, just to open the throttle valve slightly. That will allow us to start it. It should start very fast, and then it should settle down from there. So let's go. It's still quite cold at the moment, so we'll warm it up a bit, shall we? So again, halfway in the throttle, just to get it started. Stop it, just literally put a finger over the exhaust. You can see that we got nowhere near full throttle on that run around the garden. It's a very fast, very powerful car. And once warmed up, it goes really fast. Um, hope you enjoyed that. It's on eBay. If you have any questions, please ask via eBay. But uh, thank you for watching. Thank you.